This book is called Hear Your Heart by Paul Showers. Hear Your Heart. When I visit the doctor, he listens to my heart with a stethoscope. A stethoscope is cold. It makes me shiver. I like my stethoscope much better. It isn't cold. My stethoscope is a cardboard tube. My sister Lisa has one too. We save tubes and turn them into stethoscopes. Sometimes they're tubes from old rolls of to paper towels. Sometimes they are tubes from old toilet paper rolls. Any kind of cardboard tube will do. This is how you listen to someone's heart. Ask a friend to find the heartbeat on the left side of their chest. Put one end of your tube on this spot. Now put your ear on the other end. We listen to our friends' hearts and they listen to ours. Phil's heart beats like this. Pum pum, pum pum, pum pum, pum pum. Holly's heart beats the same way. So does mine. So does Lisa's. Dad's heart is a little slower. It beats like this. Kadum, 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 kadum. Andrew's only 11 months old. Mom holds him so we can listen to his heart. Andrew's heart has a very quick beat. It goes tippa, 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 tippa. Put your hand on your chest. Can you feel your heart? Your heart's about as big as your fist. It doesn't look like a heart on a valentine. It's shaped more like a pear. Your heart has tubes attached to it. When your heart beats, it moves blood through your body. Your heart is full of blood. When it beats, it squeezes itself together. That's when the heart contracts. Blood squirts out into some of the tubes. Then your heart stops squeezing and opens up again. That's when the heart expands. Blood flows into it through the other tubes. Blood flows away from your heart in tubes called arteries. Blood flows into your heart in tubes called veins. In this picture, the arteries are colored red, the veins are colored black. Your heart is a strong muscle. Night and day, it squeezes, opens, squeezes, opens. It is always beating. A heart is divided into two halves. Each half has several veins and one artery attached to it. Each half has two little doors in it. These doors are called valves. In this drawing, the valves to the arteries are colored red. The valves from the veins are black. All day long, all night long, these valves open and close, open and close. When the black valves open, the red valves close. When the red valves open, the black valves close. The valves keep the blood moving in the right direction, in from the veins, out through the arteries. When a heart beats, each half works the same way. First, blood comes in from the big veins at the top of the heart. The black valves are open. Blood flows into the heart. Then the heart contracts and pushes the blood. The black valves close. The red valves open. Blood cannot flow back into the veins. It can only flow out through the arteries. Big arteries spread out from your heart. They go to your arms and legs and head. Smaller arteries branch out from the big ones. They branch out to the top of your head, to the tips of your fingers, to the tips of your toes, to every part of your body. When the blood reaches the very smallest arteries, it passes into tiny veins. The tiny veins run into bigger and bigger veins that carry the blood back to the heart.
Touch your wrist just below your thumb. Press gently with your fingertips. Do you feel something push against your fingers? Push, push, push. You're feeling a small artery in your wrist. Your heart is pushing blood through it. Beat, push, beat, push, push, beat, push. This is your pulse. You can only feel your pulse in an artery. You can see your veins, but you cannot feel a pulse in them. Your, pul your pulse tells you how fast your heart is beating. How fast your heart is beating right now as you read this book. Get a watch with a second hand and count your pulse. How many times does your heart beat in one minute? A man's heart beats about 72 times a minute. Kadum, 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 kadum. An eight-year-old's heart beats about 90 times a minute. Pum, 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 pum. A baby's heart beats more than 120 times a minute. Tepa, 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 tepa. Sometimes it goes a little faster, sometimes a little slower. Your heart beats faster when you exercise. Try this and see for yourself. Hop up and down on one foot 20 times. Now feel your pulse. Use your watch to count your pulse. How fast is your heart beating now? Your heart beats faster when you run or jump. When you sleep, it beats much slower. A big animal's heart beats more slowly than a little animal's. An elephant's heart beats only 20 to 25 times a minute. A mouse's heart beats more than 500 times a minute. Lisa had a parakeet named Clarence. When she holds him gently, she can feel his heart beating. Pat, 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 pat. It beats so fast, we can't keep count. Your heart works all the time. No other part of your, bar of your body works as hard. Your hand is strong, but not as strong as your heart. Try this. Open your hand. Close it in a fist. Open it. Close it. How long before your hand gets tired? Your heart never gets tired. When you're awake, when you're asleep, your heart is moving blood through your body.